Dermer, Flippin' Flippin', Schmerdor, Hurdy Foot, and Flippin' Fair. That's right, we're looking at the Swedish Chef Deluxe Edition from Diamond Select Toys. This is by far one of my favorite Muppet characters of all time. This deluxe set, open up the Velcro front. Inside, we've got a nice glam shot of the Swedish Chef himself. Swedish Chef action figure with accessories, and boy howdy does he come with all sorts of great accessories. We've got a little picture of Fozzie, Miss Piggy, as well as the Diamond Select logo up here in the top right hand corner. On the side, we just got a little glimpse into the window box, and then on the back we got an overview picture of the figure and the various, and I mean various, loads of accessories he comes with. So let's go ahead and get him out of this plastic prison and inspect him closer. And there he is. Look at that. Let's look at it real close. Only a face that a mother could love. <laughs> I don't know about you, but every single time I see the Swedish Chef come on the screen, I absolutely start dying laughing. Uh, if you don't think the Swedish Chef is a funny guy, well, I don't know what to tell you. You should probably get your funny bone inspected because he's comedy gold in my opinion. But looking at the figure, face gold. Of course, we get those bushy eyebrows, big pink nose, nice, nice, nice mustache hat is attached to his head as far as articulation that's how far down his head goes so far he looks up head spins all the way around so you can look left look right as much as you want shoulders spin the shoulders all the way around spin them outwards put them to his side we have a single bicep bend wrist 360 degree swivel we also have a hinge rotate the hands in and out nice clean apron this deluxe set differs from the 2019 san diego comic-con set that one was the messy swedish chef set all the accessories and everything were the same he just had a different deco on his apron where it was covered with food and grime and all that kind of stuff that san diego comic-con set was limited to 500 pieces this deluxe set again with the, just the different apron much more easier to get it is retail price $29.99 you can find it on amazon or diamond select store i'll put product links down in the video description box below down to his legs we got those nice plaid pants we do have a little bit of hip rotation but because he's got a little bit of a belly on him as well as this apron it prevents him from rotating his hips all the way around we are able to move his legs back and forth we do have a boot cut so you can spin him around at the shin we also have a single knee bend that's as far back as it goes and that's as far forward as he can kick so not a lot of karate kid crane kicking ability from swedish chef and as far as his boot we do have a pivot and a rocker there so we're able to manipulate his foot up and down and side to side just a hair but you know it's the swedish chef he, he's going to be doing a lot of cooking he's not going to be doing a lot of action fighting let's get him posed position as far as accessories back him up a little bit we got this nice cooking table it's all painted got some faux wood grain textures to it let's see this table is right at about two inches tall and the chef himself is about four and a half inches tall with the top of his hat so it's in scale with seven inch figures of course the muppets being shorter than seven inches so when i say that people are always like uh the, the muppets aren't seven inches they're not supposed to be they're muppets they're supposed to be smaller than humans and if the human scale is seven inches well then the muppet scale is going to be three to four inches but let's talk about his accessories because by god he has tons and tons of accessories on here in fact he has 35 accessories in total so number one and two we have these uh, I, I, just, I think they're Swedish meatballs. I'm not really sure. I mean, they're just lumps of little circular balls. Uh, I assume Swedish chef, Swedish meatballs. I mean, that's literally the only thing I can think of. So dark brown of those. And then we get two more, only a different color. So these are a lighter brown. Again, I think these are Swedish meatballs. So set those off to the side. And then these things are always cracking me up. We have two apples with faces. <laughs> <laughs> the talking talking apples so we get those guys we'll set them off because they're just gonna roll right off the table and then we also have some smiling onions and you'll see right there the onions actually have teardrops these onions are already crying instead of making you cry the onions are crying so I mean just you want to talk about attention to detail diamond select put teardrops 
on these tiny, tiny onions. I mean, that is, that is stellar. And then, not to be outdone, of course, we also have some carrots. Got some nice little faced carrots. Throw those there. Then we have a ginormous cast iron skillet. So we can just throw our carrots in there, throw our onions in there, throw our apples in there. I mean, we're, we got a smorgasbord of brewing right here. So we got the cast iron skillet. We got a nice salt seasoning shaker. Then we have the baker's rolling pin. And I'm telling you guys, accessories, accessories, accessories. I cannot undersell how many amazing accessories he gets. So we have another smaller little frying pan. And then we get another smaller frying pan that's just a tiny, tiny bit bigger so they can stack into each other. And I'm just telling you right now, there's gonna be so much stuff, it's gonna fall off the table. We've got the butcher's cleaver. Even has the nice little hole there. Nice silver paint job on it. Brown on the handle, did a good job on that. We have old school tennis racket and you're like, why is there a tennis racket? Well, you know, you gotta watch more Muppets because the Swedish chef loves to play himself a little bit of tennis, a little bit of badminton. So nice old school racket. Uh, we'll just put that under the table. It doesn't belong on the cooking table. Then we have spatula, bring your focus. Nice silver spatula, little dark gray handle. Oh, falls off the table. I have a nice little ladle here. Again, dark gray handle. Then we have, uh, what I think this is like a, a Teflon skillet. This is something like you would put uh, pancakes on if you were just making a few pancakes for yourself. One of those. Then we got another smaller, oh, what, what is the official terminology for this? Uh, I, I'm definitely not a chef. I, I forget what these things are called. I just call them a spatula. Everything's a spatula to me. If it, if it moves food off a plate or stirs it around, it's a spatula to me. Uh, cooking spoon, there we go. Got, got one right. Nice little silver cooking spoon. A wooden spoon. Nice little brown wooden spoon. And I hope you're, hope you're keeping count because I'm telling you, there's tons of accessories. A nice little wooden fork. Bork and bork and fork. And we have a little wooden mallet. I guess so we can pound those Swedish meatballs. Then we have two hands. So two different, whoa, and I lost it. Two different hands for our chef. These are just gripping hands. That way we can put more utensils in there. This one's a little more closed. And same thing here. The ones he comes with installed are a little wider, so they got a bigger grip. Then we have a cooking pot. Big cooking pot there. And we have a bit of a, a steaming pot. Again, I'm not a chef, so I'm trying to recall the official names of these. Everything's a pot to me, but I'm pretty sure this is for steaming. You throw like some lobsters in there. Again, another one, slightly smaller. So this one's a little shorter stack, but again, another cooking pot, all silver, throw it there. A ginormous pot, big old cooking pot. So definitely a lot of lobsters thrown in here. Set that there. Yet one more, this one's a little more different. It's got a rounded base on it. So a boiler, boiler pot, that's what we're gonna call this one. Boiling pot. One more kind of cast iron skillet here. And the last but not least, the chicken. This is Camilla, I do believe. This is Gonzo's lady friend, Camilla the chicken. Throw here on top. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the deluxe set of the Diamond Select Swedish Chef figure. Let me move some things out of the way. And again, talking about scale, we got Diamond Select, comic book Thanos behind him. Let's see what he looks like. The chicken, of course, the Swedish Chef, and then impending doom behind him, we got comic book Thanos. Again, for scale, Thanos is about eight inches tall, Swedish Chef much smaller you know and he's he's right at arm's reach so why am i showing this well you know disney owns marvel disney owns the muppet let's have a crossover marvel versus the muppets i think we need it what do you guys think let me know in the comments down below what you think of this figure and if you're interested in picking it up again i'll put product links down in the video description box below so you can pick up your very own deluxe swedish chef 
Anyways, hope you enjoyed the content. If you did, make sure you hit that like button, share this video with your friends if you found the information helpful. And as always, thanks for watching, guys. It really means a lot.